It's a new season of stewardship at St. Mary's Episcopal Church in Stewart. And we thought you'd like to hear why other parishioners give to St. Mary's. Hi, I'm Bob Bish, and this is why I give to St. Mary's. We asked Bob Bish how long he and his wife Beth have been attending St. Mary's. Beth and I have attended St. Mary's for over 20 years. Then we wanted to know what ministries they're a part of at St. Mary's. We became interested in volunteering. And Father Todd uh, uh, encouraged me to be the treasurer of the church. And Beth uh, was recruited to join the Stephen ministry. And so those are the two ministries that have been the most meaningful to us uh, in recent years. We asked Bob to share the revelation on giving he received at St. Mary's. I remember Father Todd took me to lunch when I was being vetted for the job. And during our conversation, I asked him about financial stewardship. Uh, while we pledged to all the churches we've ever been members of, we never really understood the biblical view of tithing. And Father Todd suggested that we consider 10% of our income. So. I, I went home after lunch and got my old tax return out and determined what my taxable income was. And Beth and I talked about it and we agreed that we would use 10% of our taxable income as our target. But that's only half the story. Our pledge to St. Mary's was now more than uh, just a tax or uh, a, a bag of groceries. It was a gift from God uh, to finance the, the advancement of his kingdom right here at St. Mary's. And that gave me great joy. Finally, Bob shared this advice for the new season of stewardship at St. Mary's. I would certainly encourage everyone to consider going through the process and then, and then doing what feels right for them. Please consider increasing your pledge gift in this new season of stewardship at St. Mary's. <music>